I have something for you, my Buddha. This is going to be the first time I see a big adult Dubia Roach. I've always ordered the small Dubia Roaches. These are the thousand right here. Extra small Dubias for 40 and one adult male and four females for... Okay. So here we have the four female. Oh my gosh, they're so... F Holy sh... That turns into that. Are you kidding me? Dude, come out here and take a look at this. Look at that. So thick. I'm not scared of insects, but ever since that SpongeBob episode of the freaking butterfly, we also have a heating pad. These guys require 90 degree temperature to breed. What's up, Hanzo? What you doing? You cannot eat my breeders. I am so sorry, Hanzo, but you cannot eat the breeders. <laughs> He finished these like in 11 days. I was letting him eat a tremendous amount. Kind of tone it down a little bit on the amount of dubia roaches I let him eat. Hopefully these start reproducing. Looks like they're already going at it. A roach just like my ex. Look, it's eating. Count and actually limit the amount he eats. Come on, eat some f greens, dude. Oh, you look pretty good. So I bet you don't. I've been looking at videos about dubia roach breeding and there isn't any videos of people actually starting the colony. There's only how to start the colony. So I'm making a video exactly when I start the colony and how to start a colony. I oh know, I'll feed you and everything. Let's see if he stays on the shoulder. I ordered five, one, two, three, four. There's seven in here. Go ahead, little guy. Probably like, damn, this floor is cold. This is pretty much everything you need to start the dubia roach breeding. Some adult size roaches. We were supposed to have four adult females and one adult male. So they tossed in two extra roaches. These are the feeders. We are not mixing those two. These are just for him to eat. We got a heating pad. The ideal breeding temperature for these guys is around 90 degrees. So that's what this is for. And we have something for them to hide in. We're going to go ahead and put these vertically. So when they do poo and stuff, it just falls down. I'm trying to make a video. Go ahead and open this and let them free. These guys can't fly. The males do have wings, but they don't fly. They could only glide. Males are a little bit smaller. Yeah, it looks like he wants it. Have a little piece of orange for them to eat. You don't really want to put water in this because they will drown. So the ideal thing to do is to get some crystallized water. Those are the adults, dude. What do you think? You guys think he could eat one? I don't think he could. Really does want to. Let me in there. I will end their whole career. Heater. This one was around 26 doll hair. We're going to stick this on the side right here. Put this right here. I'm all f***ing up the breeders, huh, Dan? That one's most definitely female. That one's a male. Looks like there's two males and all the rest are females. No time we will have some babies. They got the food, they got the heating. All they need is the crystallized water. To 
Damn. These guys do prefer a darker environment. So the fish tank isn't most ideal, but these guys are going to be living in the garage covered up. I'm going to have to go ahead and order some crystallized water. We got two males and five females. All right, ratio. The ideal ratio is one to four. So let's hope these little guys start producing babies soon. Of course, the reason to start this is so you won't have to buy feeders all the time for your little guy. Hoping these guys start producing in at least two weeks. This guy literally just dug through all this to try and get to the roaches. He said, get out of here, greens. I want the roach. Nice. been restricting him to around 10 to 15 dubia roaches every feeding he hasn't done a feeding frenzy in quite a minute so let's go ahead and nice little feeding frenzy see how many roaches he eats dubia countdown one two three four whoa Five. Six. Whoa, he is wrestling with this. Sanaorias. Seven. Literally inside of him. Eight. I used to let him do this every Nine. feeding. That's probably why he went through a thousand of these super quick. Look at him just circling. Ten. Eleven. Swoop, swoop. Twelve. Boop, there's another one. 13, 14, honestly, don't 15, even know if he'll get full, oh my gosh, he topped it over, 16, he sees him, 17, 18, 19, fact, not really sure if he'll just run off at this point, he's a baby, they have no limit to what they can eat, honestly, just fat asses. 25. 26. Look at him, dude. Damn. Think he missed. There's some on the ground, dude. 27. Oh. 28. Oh, looks like he slowed down a bit. 28. 29. He's all like, yes, I needed one of these. Ah, I got you, my Buddha. Look, soon, hopefully, we'll have a nice breeding colony for this guy. 30. 31. But for the meantime, I'm going to have to order him. Thirty-five. So many is how many has that been? You guys gotta realize that every lunch he does is a strike. Forty. Okay, this is ridiculous. Forty-one. <laughs> Look at his little tummy. Let's zoom in on his tummy. It's not that bad. Damn it. Forty-two. I need to be feeding him more. 
43. Eat my Bruda. Okay, let's put all of these away. And 44. Let's let them. 45. Oh, damn. Hold on. Forty-six. There's some in here, dude. Oh, I swear I could feel them moving inside of him. He's all like, what the hell did you say? 47. Pretty sure he's down to finish all the rest that are in the plate, dude. You don't have to. 48. But you want to. Should we name him Tiger? I don't really want to scare the doobie 49. off because he will eat them all. So I'm going to go ahead and take him off. And take the remaining doobie and put them back inside. And 50. Oh. 50 doobie roaches. If they're all. 20 cents a pop. Is that 20 times If I make 50? a move, he'll most definitely just lunge at everything. $10. This little guy literally just ate $10 in front of your face. Feel free to follow me on Instagram and on Snapchat at KZ underscore production.